What up, it's your boy Naftastic, and welcome to another episode of the Stains Massive. Starting the episode here with a potential offer seen available to us. So Papa Booba Diop is available in a free transfer, and he has the ability to really improve our midfield. And he wants to be under 18's coach too, which is just an absolute bonus. So I'm going to offer terms. We're going to go slightly above our wage uh, budget, but. That means we can finally let Dylan McClay go out on loan. Um, we had a very good cup run, but we know that in this sort of division, when you go on cup runs, it impacts the league form. I think that's what we've been going through. So hopefully we don't continue that, but we play a very difficult Dagenham and Redbridge side here. And the conditions sort of don't help our style of play. But we are playing at home, even if our home is the Valley still. Um, can't even finish my sentence before we can see it. So it's so it's seven minutes in and we're right under the cross tray away. Oh jeez, it's wave after wave of attack. Come on, let's get it out. There you go. It's better. Oh, so unlucky. Rollins is injured. We're going to bring on Agatha Davids. Obviously, you can see there why I had to sign Papa Boo up. That's your top. Midfield options, it's a bit concerning. We're still only 1 0 down, we're still in this game. But we know another goal, goal from Dagenham will kill us, kill us off. Oh, what is that about? Come on, Jack, man. It's just. It should be the voting of that. Don't want to see those kind of errors. Really upsetting. Oh, it's a good move as well, the going in confidence. Heads are definitely sunk there, as you can see, looking frustrated. Come on, boys. It's going to put on Calvin Kennedy. Try and protect the midfield as we go into attack. That's better, come on. 2-0 I mean I could take it losing but a second goal oh my god it still riles me up well there you go Papa Booba Diop Senegalese legend <laughs> Veshra midfielder is definitely the way to describe him again a very difficult game again Accrington Stanley you've won one and lost one against them and they'll want a bit of revenge for a cup win, so it's another tough one, I'm afraid. I can send you, I need better from you. Diop's making his debut. Um, it, um, it might take him a while to actually um, mesh in with the rest of the squad, but hopefully, he can do that. Defence is slow to react to the run, which is a clever run, but didn't really react to it, and the keeper sort of just looks like he half saved it. But it's a great response then. Huertes beauty. I'm hoping that trio of Huertes, Quintero, and Bambi can blossom together. Definitely have the ability to sort of become players at the next level. I mean, they've all come from academies in the Premier League, Chelsea, Liverpool and uh, United. So, they have a good start to their career, hopefully they can continue it. It's 
Set bounce round. Oh. Just another 20 minutes to go. See if we can go for the bring, bring on Hayden and Nasty SA. Looks a very end to end. Oh, it's a good goal. So close again. <laughs> it's just going that way. You need to take your chances when you get them because you'll get punished. Simple as that. And that's 3-1. It's probably an undeserved scoreline, but... Right now, it's the difference right now. Just to, they're just a bit more ruthless with their play. We're still wasting a lot of chances. I mean, we're quite safe at the moment, but we don't want to keep losing, otherwise we're going to get dragged closer and closer to that... the perils of relegation, so they say. I mean, thankfully we still have the cup, FA Cup in the fourth round, so there's still excitement for us, but... We need to improve our league form, that's for sure. And they're just doing. They will put Walsall next, as you can see there, in the bottom paragraph. Another very tough game. They've beaten us before and com quite comprehensively, I think. So I'm not particularly confident about this game either. Which is not the <laughs> the attitude you want to have right now. I mean, what I don't understand is we can beat almost anyone in the in the FA Cup at the moment, but struggling against our teams that we've beaten already in the league so just need that sort of run of one or two games just to get us going you know it's doing, it's doing okay so far oh injury Jinxed it, didn't I? Get that one. Hope it's not too big an impact, but it's a major loss there. I left that one. Straight away, the attack down that side. Going to half time nil nil, which is quite good for us. We're happy with the nil nil draw if it stays that way. But it's going to be a tough fight for it in order to keep it that way. That's for sure. Nice. Go on. Oh, lucky. The. Oh. Good finish. Again, the difference between us and the top sides in this league right now. Taking your chances. Hopefully the subs can uh, do that for us, but... Warsaw are growing in confidence now. <sighs> Close. Quite lucky not to concede that. Whack it in there. Oh, God, to take those chances. So, another loss to Atar. Ever increasingly poor record in the league. Hopefully playing Newport County, a team that we should win will help boost that. I mean, I just, at the moment, just want us to stop losing. 
and that's probably what we're going to look to get out of this game is a draw just because we are away morale's low just need something just losses just flow of losses come on there you go force it in there keep pushing for it boys keep pushing They're actually having a good amount of possession, but we're doing well. We just need to continue our calm head and try and score more goals. Oh, I'm a bit worried there. We still look vulnerable on the counter, which is strange because I'm playing on the counter myself. I think, oh. I think one of the major issues we'll have to address in the summer is this defending. I mean, there's no one available or free at the moment. We need someone to really uh, improve the back four because that's our main vulnerability. Maybe even goalkeeper. And Jets done alright, but it's massively uh, there's these errors that keep cropping up, which really are a problem. Not much happening at the minute. I'm just going to try and take off these injured players and uh, hopefully change the game for the better. Hopefully, the fresh legs can uh, kill this tie off. Come on, we have to beat these guys. <sighs> Nothing's happened in this half. It's been quite. Oh, hello. No. So, like I said beforehand, would take a draw, but I was hoping we'd beat Newport County. It is what it is. Um, McGlade's going out on loan, which I said we'd do at the start of the episode. But we'll come back in the next episode for the fourth round of the FA Cup. Hopefully we can progress in that and help use that to boost our league form. But until then, I'll catch you guys later. Have a good one, and bye-bye uh, now.